There's some controversy as to whether or not it has to be treated. Definitely if it's, if it's symptomatic and is impacting your quality of life or causing aspiration and possible pneumonia, it should be treated. But if it's not impacting your quality of life significantly, there's some thought uh, that you can leave it alone, but there's also some thought by leaving it there untreated, you may actually worsen or weaken uh, the swallowing muscles above it. Uh, this is still unclear. Um, that being said, the, the SAT can be treated in uh, multiple ways. Uh, two general categories is one is transcervical or going, uh, making a cut in the neck and going through the neck, which is the more traditional way of treating it, uh, and then removing the sac completely. The more recent treatment is endoscopic, which is through the mouth. This will cause often less pain, less discomfort, and a faster recovery, but it may have a slightly larger recurrence. The way that's done is you actually cut the party wall between the sac and the esophagus, creating one large cavity. So the sac is still there, but any food or liquid that goes into it will flow right out um, into the esophagus and down into your stomach. And you can cut that wall either using a stapler or using a laser or a harmonic scalpel.